Greetings and welcome to our official YouTube channel Petaka Technologies. In this video, let's see how to replace blank value with zero using Power BI DAX functions. In this example, we have team wise ticket details and need to create a report like this using Power BI slicer, Power BI card and we are also going to replace blank with zero using DAX function in Power BI measure. In this source data, we have three columns. First column contains team details. Second column contains closed tickets count. And third column contains feedback requested count. We do have null values in the source data. For example, team DRR does not contain closed tickets and feedback requested count. Due to this, we will get blank value in Power BI visuals. Let's see how we can handle this blank value and replace blank value with zero to show zero instead of blank with the help of Power BI DAX functions. With the help of this source data, we are going to create a report to show team wise closed tickets and feedback requested count. In Power BI report tab, we can see source data columns in right hand side. To create a slicer, select slicer visual from visualization section and drag team column from source data and placed it in field section of slicer visual. After successful placement, now we can see the slicer listed out with various team names in this slicer. Next, we will create a card visual. Select card visual from visualization section and drag closed tickets column from source data and place it in field section of card visual. After successful placement, we can see the card visual with number of closed tickets. Let's duplicate this card visual by copy and paste it and replace closed tickets with feedback requested column and card visual looks like this. Now we can see the number of feedback requested. We will create a shape to place the title for this report. To create a shape, go to insert tab and select shapes and it will list out the available shapes. From the list, select the rectangle shape. We have typed the report name in the rectangle shape using text option in format shape section of rectangle shape and formatted it as per the convenient. In team slicer, if I select a BCC team, then data will get filter and in card visual, it will show only the filter data for BCC team, closed tickets count is 234 and feedback requested count is 201. Next, in team slicer, if I select DRR team, then data will get filter and I can see only blank in card visuals, but I don't want to show blank as a result in card visuals for my clients. So I want to replace this blank with zero. For this, I need to create a new measure for writing DAX functions. In Power BI Desktop, you can easily write a custom DAX function by adding a new measure to the source table for replacing blank with zero. 
to create new measure select the ohm tab on the ribbon then select new measure the dax formula bar appears we renamed the initial name of the measure with closed count and type equal sign to write dax function to replace blank with zero in power bi we use dax function if to checks a condition and returns one value when it's true otherwise it returns a second value inside of if dax function we use sum dax function to get the total of closed tickets count we provided the condition as if total of closed tickets count is equal to 0 if this condition satisfies or true then result should be show as 0 if this condition fails or false then it should return the sum or total of closed tickets count and close the if function using closing parenthesis again we need to create one more measure for replacing blank with zero for feedback requested count to create a new measure in ohm tab select new measure the dax formula bar appears we renamed the initial name of the measure with requested count and type equal sign to write dax function to replace blank with zero in power bi we use dax function if to check a condition and returns one value when it's true otherwise it returns a second value inside of if dax function we use sum dax function to get the total of feedback requested count also we provided the condition as if total of feedback requested count is equal to 0 if this condition satisfies or true then result should be show as 0 if this condition fails or false then it should return the sum or total of feedback requested count and close the if function using closing parenthesis in closed tickets code visual we will replace the closed tickets column with closed count measure and it will show zero instead of blank in feedback requested code visual we will replace the feedback requested column with requested count measure and it will show zero instead of blank if i change the team in slicer closed tickets count and feedback requested count get changed accordingly that's it we have successfully replaced the blank with zero using power bi dax functions in power bi measure and also visualized data in power bi chord visual if this video helpful to you give us a like and share this video with others and watch other video with tutorials from petaka technologies if you have any questions or you can share your feedback in below comments section To watch more videos like this, visit our official YouTube channel Petaka Technologies. To get notifications on new upcoming videos, hit that subscribe button and activate bell icon. That's all for this video. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video.